Hi team. Hi Yoshi. Hi Yoshi. How are you doing? All right. Okay. Pretty good. You have done an excellent job doing home office. I was impressed. All right. Yay. So, I really have nothing to add on that end. Super. Cool. Something got me really concerned last night, and I couldn't sleep. The temperature these days are going up and down. This is a Monopoly game. Yeah, I can see that. As a kid, I really liked to play this game, and always turned out to be a rich mogul. All right. So much about foreseeing the future. Are you not doing that bad? As an engineer, this is the only economic model I have in my mind. So I started to toy around with this last night. Uh huh. Okay. You play this game. You walk around the city, earn money, and start buying streets, invest in houses and hotels. So everyone is doing quite well in this thriving economy. And the adrenaline and dopamine in your veins pumping like crazy. And life is good. Now, a friendly visitor comes along called COVID-19. You're stuck in your place, you have no income and still have to pay your daily dues. Good that we are employed. Now, usually when recession hits, the government spends tons of money to build streets, bridges, and libraries. So, a lot of money is flowing into the economy, but also is creating value. So there's a balance. However, this time, the government spends billions and billions of dollars, euros, and yens so that you can buy basic stuff, such as food and cover rent. Now, that's monkey money. What the hell is a monkey money? Even a monkey can walk into the store with a handful of cash and buy bananas to survive, right? Survival money, monkey money, monkey money, monkey money. So all the corporations in here take all the money hidden in the tax haven and pull it back into the economy so they can cover the overheads not producing much. And that's scary. That's an apeshit load of monkey money going bananas in an economy without creating a lot of equivalent values. That's scary, isn't it? Especially in an environment with extremely low interest rates where corporations are borrowing like crazy and debts are skyrocketing. Now the business and economics people should explain to me that this is still going to be okay or point out any errors that I have made in my logic. And all the engineers should come up with a computer simulation or draw an analogy to electric circuits using transistors as money multipliers and tell me that this huge slow stream and current is not going to burn down the system. And that's your homework. I have a question. Yes? Do we have a lot of money stashed away in tax haven? Um, I am a Low-level manager, we've done a lot of acquisitions in the past, but uh, I don't know anything about uh, money flows. Whenever Yoshi lies, um, he gets a very heavy Japanese accent. Bad poker player. What? Uh, see you next week. Bye.